Hello everybody, Puzzle Pieces here with more of Emerald City Confidential. We are leaving the university to go and find General Ginger, who is chasing down Ansel. So let's go back to uh, TikTok to ask where Ginger is. Hey, TikTok, I have some more questions for you. You may ask. Uh, talk about old times. Do you still talk to General Ginger? She is my commanding officer. Ginger outranks TikTok now? There's no justice. <laughs> Where can I find her? General Ginger has responded to a disturbance at the dock. She should still be there if you wish to speak to her. I don't, but thanks. Ooh, new location. Not the safest spot to be at night, but it's one of the best for information. Okay. Old times. Let's talk about the old days, TikTok. If we must. Uh, still in the Royal Guard, I see. Still in the Royal Guard, I see. It is an honor and a privilege to serve Queen Ozma. I'm sure she feels the same way. <laughs> so, how's the old gang doing? That's official business. Oh, come on, it's me. I used to be one of you. Precisely. You are no longer one of us. Oh. Ask again, and I will be forced to take action. Fine, I get the point. So, TikTok, how long has it been? 16 years, 3 months, <laughs> 2 weeks, 5 days, and 11 minutes. That long, huh? Where does the time go? I cannot say. Actually, never mind about the old days. I have some general questions. Any question put to me, I will answer. Within reason. Yeah. Uh... Okay. So what are you doing here, exactly? First line of defense. You honestly expect another invasion. It is not my place to ask. Unlike some, I do not shirk my duty. That's not fair. Yeah. You know it. I only speak the truth. Hmm. Why does the city need such a huge gate? You were here when the Fanfasms attacked the city, were you not? Yeah, I remember. They came from the north. Precisely. This is where our defenses need to be strongest. It's been a long time since then. I guess it's easy to forget. Not for me. Mm. Tell me about the Gillikin country, beyond the gate. Ahem. Gillikin is the northern division of Oz, denoted by the color purple. It is home to wild jungles and forests. And exiles, right? And for illegal magic users who try to escape the law. Yes. Actually, oh. never mind. Okay. Well, that gives me a little bit more uh, information. Only doing my duty. All right, so oh wait, uh, docks. Yes, that's right. Go to the docks. General Ginger. Oh, looks like someone wrecked his boat. Oh, I see a flash up here. I'm trying to get this button. Perfect. There was no magic. Yes, there was. Magic was involved in this, and neither of you have a license. Hey. You can't pin this on us. Oh, yes, I can. You were experimenting with magic and it destroyed your ship. It's obvious. That's a lie. It's a conspiracy, I'm telling you. Someone's trying to drive us out of business. Leave the theories to me, girl. Captain Bill, where were you last night? I told you, I was at Ruggedo's. Ruggedo? Consorting with a known enemy of Oz? No, I was just having a drink. Sure you were. You leave him alone! He didn't do anything! Are you saying it was you, Trot? No! It wasn't either of us! Now why would we destroy our own ship? It's our livelihood! Mm -hmm. Perhaps it was an accident. Perhaps you didn't mean to. Magic is dangerous. That's why it's illegal. We didn't touch no magic! That's a double negative. That means you did. What? Trot, keep quiet! Why? Does she have something to hide? I'll tan your hide if you don't leave us alone! Whoa! Trot, I'll handle this. But Bill! What gives you the right to treat innocent folk this way? Queen Ozma gives me the right. Ozma wouldn't want you arresting us. We used to be friends. Used to be, yes. She has no time for friends anymore. Just tell me what magic you used, and maybe she'll be lenient. There was no magic. Yes, there was. Magic was involved in this, and neither of you have a license. Hey! You can't pin this oh, okay, so oh, she's yes, just going around and around. Under normal circumstances, I would rather cut out my tongue than chat with General Ginger. But 700 emeralds you. weren't normal Someone's circumstances. Trying to drive us out of business. Hey, General. Still picking on the downtrodden? Petra, what rock did you crawl out from under? Nice to see you, too. I'm busy, Petra. Run along. Ginger isn't gonna talk to me. She's trying to arrest those two sailors. 
They seem innocent enough. Maybe there's something around here that will prove it. Okay. Leave the theories to me, girl. Captain Bill, where were you last night? I told you, I was at Ruggedo's. Ruggedo? Consorting with a known enemy of Oz? No, I was just having a drink. Sure you were. We're coming, you which alone, means somebody else is here. Should show this to General Ginger. Trot? No, it wasn't either of us. Now why would we destroy our own hey. ship? General, right, take a look at this. What is it now? It was on the edge of the dock, near the, the remains of the ship. Yeah, exactly. Someone else was there. Bill, Trot, do you recognize this? No. Nope. I think you're lying. Oh, Go for Lurleen's sake. Lurleen. Over with a ruby inlay. Do you really think it belongs to them? Hmm. Perhaps you're right. Okay, you two are off the hook for now. Get out of here. I'll have more questions for you later. If they were smart, they get out of town. But if people were smart, I'd be out of business. <laughs> Yay! Hey, we did them all! Woohoo! Bye, guys. Wait, I need to talk to you. So, General Petra, why are you here? And who asked you to interrupt my investigation? Just being a concerned citizen, General. You stopped being <laughs> concerned the day you quit the Royal Guard. Ginger could always push my buttons. You know why I left. Yeah, I do. How is your brother doing anyway? She's asking for a punch in the nose. <laughs> but I'm not going to give her the satisfaction. Yeah, she can arrest you for that. Uh, Ansel. I need help on a case. Help? I wouldn't come to you if I could go anywhere else, believe me. What makes you think I'd give you the time of day? Talking to Ginger was like swimming upstream. There was only one trip left to try. Here's 20 emeralds. What time is it? You're lucky it's a slow night. You can <laughs> ask whatever you want, but it doesn't mean I'll answer. Do you know a man named Ansel? That guy? Sure, I know him. What do you want with him? I'm looking for him. <laughs> you deserve each other. It's not like that. Betsy told me you arrested him. I gave chase. That guy is more slippery than a greased fish. He got away? I'm shocked, General. Shocked and disappointed. <laughs> I thought General Ginger always catches the bad guy. Oh, I'll get him. A guy like that doesn't stay underground for long. What do you know about him? He's smuggling scum. Is what oh, okay, he is. so he is smuggling, smuggling something. That's what I said. He tried to hide some stuff at Betsy's place. He won't try that again in a hurry. So, Ansel is a smuggler. That makes things interesting. Anybody with an ear to the ground knows how smuggling works in the Emerald City. If smuggling is involved, Jack Pumpkinhead is pulling Jack the Pumpkin! Yeah. Where is he now? Our investigations are continuing. We'll find him. Well, if you find him, give him to me, because I have a client. Actually, I have nothing else to ask you. Suits me just fine. Uh, old times. About back then. What about it? What happened after I left? We won the war. What do you think? While you were turning over stones, we sent the phantasms packing. And here you are now, strong-arming innocent sailors. Shut <laughs> your mouth, Petra. You're attracting flies. Wow, what an insult. I had to leave. You know that, don't you? We were at war. You abandoned your post. There's no excuse for that. Okay. Why didn't you help me? That's all I wanted, just a little help. It had nothing to do with us. You weren't the only one with family, Petra. That's why we were fighting, to protect our families. What made your brother more important than anyone else's? Because he was mine. Then we True. have nothing more to discuss. Actually, let's talk about something else. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Trot and Bill. About Trot and Bill. What about them? What happened? What happened here? It's none of your business, Petra. <sighs> Looks like the remains of a ship. Brilliant. I can see why you're a detective. Oh. Who does that cufflink belong to? I don't know, Petra. You just gave it to me. I'll take a look at it later. <laughs> okay. Never mind. Okay, we'll leave. Be around, General. Yeah, sure. Okay. So, I don't think we need anything here, and I already had the button up here. Alright, so, uh, we got information that he is a smuggler, and 
that um, Betsy was probably hiding stuff for him. Oh, yeah. Woo, Jack. So this is the uh, character from um, um, Return to Oz, where the really uh, kind of creepy Jim, or uh, not Jim Hansen, uh, someone else, um, version. So he's in that one. Hello, Jack. Long time no see. It's been at least two years, hasn't it? Not long enough. You flatter me. I need to ask you a couple of questions. I haven't done anything, I haven't seen anything, and <laughs> nobody saw me do anything. Let me ask my questions first. Ask whatever you want, but I just gave my answers. <laughs> nice, uh, New York accent. Uh, Ansel. I want to ask you about Ansel. Ansel? Who's that? I'll ask the questions, Jack. Who is Ansel? <laughs> Who is Ansel? How should I know? I never heard of the guy. So you say. Ah. Uh. Ansel was a smuggler, Jack. So? So, you're a smuggler too. You tried to pin that on me two years ago, Petra. It didn't work then, and it ain't gonna work now. Where is Ansel, Jack? Come on, spill it. I ain't got nothing to spill, lady. I never heard of Ansel, and I certainly don't know where he is. Curse those expressionless eyes. I can never tell if he's lying or not. <laughs> you know what? Forget it. Done and done. Uh. You've got some nice pumpkins here, Jack. You want some? I can give you a good price. Thanks, but no. So, what's inside those pumpkins? What do you mean? Come on, Jack, play straight with me. We both know what's inside your pumpkins. What? Goopy pumpkin stuff? Seeds? What could you possibly be referring to? Nah. Pumpkin Head was always a cool customer. I know he's lying, and he knows that I know. And there isn't a single thing I can do about it. Aww. Oh. What would happen if I broke one of those pumpkins open? I'd call up the guard and have you arrested for destroying property. And if I discovered something that shouldn't be there? You want to take that risk again? Be my guest. He's right. I did that very thing two years ago and nearly got arrested for my trouble. Huh. I learned two important lessons that day. Yeah. One, a man smuggling illegal magic goods inside pumpkins wouldn't leave the offending pumpkins out in the open. Mm -hmm. And two, Jack isn't as stupid as he looks. You know what? I'm sick of talking about pumpkins. <laughs> then you're in the wrong place. Leave, why don't you? Tell me about smuggling, Jack. Oh, that old story. Didn't you try this two years ago? You got nothing on me, so beat it. Just humor me. Uh... <laughs> I'm here to pick up that illegal artifact. How does a smuggling operation work? I have no idea what you're talking about. Oz is a magical kingdom, but magic artifacts and goods are now illegal. Yeah, ain't that a shame? But most magical artifacts are small. Small enough to fit inside a pumpkin, perhaps? Sure, whatever you say. Now there's a thought. Pumpkins could be the perfect cover for smuggling magic artifacts in and out of the city. Yeah, yeah, you gave me the same song and dance years ago. You here to make up stories, or do you have a real reason for being here? <sighs> I have a magic artifact I need to smuggle out of the <laughs> Lying! <laughs> nice try. I'm here to pick up that More lying. magical artifact. Lurline, give me strength. I'm an honest businessman, lady. Clear off. Honest. Sure. Yeah. And I'm Queen Ozma. <laughs> I know you're a smuggler, Jack. Everybody knows. How come you haven't been pinched? Because I haven't done anything. Never mind. Good. Uh. See you later, Jack. The gump stand is that away. Feel free to use it. Ah, uh, sweet Lorelai, I'm tired. I need to head back to the office and relax. Maybe things will make more sense after some eye shut. Or shall I? <laughs> eye shut. Yeah. If I eye shut, I'll be okay. Let's go back to the office. Yeah, I don't see any buttons out here. Oh, I think I saw a button. Oh, hi, Trot. <clears throat> oh, hello. How did you get in here? The door was unlocked. No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. Yeah, okay. Well, it was eventually. Listen, Trot, was it? Yeah? Listen, Trot, I've just got one thing to say. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Everything is just get out. Get out. Oh, come on, please. I need your help. I don't help thieves. I wasn't stealing anything. I was just... 
waiting for you. Uh-huh. I want to hire you. I've already got a case. Can't you take on another? That stupid General Ginger is harassing us. I don't know where else to go. Please listen. I can pay. Hmm. Mm. An opportunity to bug the general and get paid for it? Mm. Maybe yeah. she's on the level. All right, kid, you've got five minutes. Spell. Thank you. You were at the dock earlier, right? You remember what happened? Okay, so in the next video, we're going to hear uh, uh, Trot's tale here. So uh, do stay tuned. This is Puzzle Pieces signing off.